In the video for today, I'm going to show you how to log into your WhatsApp account on two different devices using the same number. Now, two different devices could be a laptop and a mobile phone or two different mobile phones. So in order for you to understand how to do this properly, you need to watch my video till the end. Let's get into the video for today. So the first thing is I want you to get hold of a different device like a laptop. Once you do that, get onto a browser or you open the Chrome browser directly and you type in WhatsApp on Google search. You get all the results. Click on WhatsApp.com. You get directed to the official page for WhatsApp. Okay, if you want, you could go through this page. It's simple and easy to understand, but you want to log into your account out here. Click on WhatsApp web, get your phone, open WhatsApp. The next thing is to click on the menu option. You get a drop down, click on settings. Then you need to click on this QR icon. Here you need to select scan code and you would need to scan the code out here or just uh, align it and click on continue. Click on link a uh, device. Unlock this. If you're having a pattern, you could use pattern. If you need to put in fingerprint, you could put in fingerprint. That's totally uh, how you've set up your device. And to the bottom here on your mobile phone, you will get an option to link with phone number. Instead, click on that option. Here, you would need to enter a code. You get back to your laptop and click on link with phone number. You put in your phone number out here. Click on next. And then you put in this code, which is shown on screen quickly. Once you put in the code, you're automatically going to be logged into your account on your laptop also. So now you are logged into your phone and your laptop. And if you want to log into your WhatsApp account on a different mobile phone, get hold of another Android device. And after that, open the Chrome browser or the Firefox browser, get to whatsapp.com and follow the same procedure. You would need to do it on the browser itself. So I hope this makes sense. And I hope I was able to provide some value. If I did, give my video a thumbs up, post a comment, subscribe and hit the bell notification icon. Take care, my friend.